are the icing on my cake You are the smile I can't replace So you are, you are The way you smile, the way you laugh, the way I Can't help but catch your joy, your joy I know it's been a really, 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 really long time. I'm so sorry. This is, I think, the fifth time that I'm filming this video. Every time I tried to edit my, um, yeah, like my makeup collection. Oh, by the way, this is going to be a makeup collection, as you can tell from the title. Title. Title down there. Title down there. No, down there, right? So, every time I tried to edit it, it's either too shaky because this is kind of like a walking around video and I apparently have very shaky hands. Um, or my laptop just shuts down every time I try to edit it. So yeah, this is me trying again. So, let's just get started. Okay, so this is my vanity. Nothing special, like, at all. It's really average. I mean, I'm 18, so I can't really afford anything super fancy. Uh, but yeah, that's me. Hi! Oh, these lights, I think, are from Walmart. My mom redid them a bit. We found a tutorial on how to do vanity lights on YouTube. You can search for it. And that's what she did. She had to rewire them. And it was kind of really hard to make sure it was centered. So it's not really, it's not really even. I don't know if you can tell. But it's not really even, but they're very useful. And I love them. Oops, just tripped on my own chair. But yeah, I love them. This is probably from like Walmart, Target. You can get these anywhere. Yeah, they're really basic, just plastic. So these are some mascaras. Yeah, I think this is L'Oreal. I don't really use most of these. I really like this one, but I haven't used it recently. I like this one too. I like all of them, except for I think this one. Um, it's not as impressive as I used to think it was. I have a first impression, but what I think of it now is, I don't remember, I don't remember what I said in my first impression of this, but for me right now, I feel like this does nothing for my lashes. And I have pretty long lashes already, but this, it's like not putting any kind of mascara on at all. It's really weird. Maybe it dried out, I don't know. I don't really like it anymore. Or maybe I've never liked it. I really don't remember. Um, these are some colorful mascaras that I never really use. <laughs> but I have them. My sisters play around with them sometimes. I have like disposable wands that they use. This I've had for years. I should probably throw it out. These are my eyeliners. I have gel liner. This is my favorite gel liner. I think it's by L'Oreal. This is by L'Oreal. I love it. I actually really bad at gel liner, but if I'm gonna use gel liner, I go for this one. One of my favorite liquid liners. I usually use liquid liners. I really like this one. I've been using it for a long time now, but recently I've been using the NYC one, which is pretty good too. I also have an e.l.f. one. Wait, that's not my e.l.f. one. That one dried up for me. I like the BH Cosmetics one. I have a Maybelline one that actually was like pretty much dried out. Oops. Pretty much dried out when I bought it, so I'm not very impressed. Though I do hear nice reviews. Where is my un Where is my e.l.f. one? Okay, I have an e.l.f. one somewhere. These are my pencil liners. I have NYX Jumbo Eye Pencils. I have, I think this is by e.l.f. Um, I have NYC. I have Wet n Wild. Yeah, I just have a bunch. I have a ton, a ton of these. My camera hasn't been feeling like focusing for some reason, but it says Italia or something. I think I got them from eBay, to be honest. I got a huge pack. And they're really creamy. I actually do like them. These are like my most unused palette eyeshadows. This is one by Sephora. I really... It's not that pigmented. My mom got this from Puerto Rico years ago. I was probably like maybe 
11. This used to be my favorite eyeshadow palette, of course, when I was 11. Um, um, I haven't used this since then, but I remember loving it. Um, this one's pretty good, but I, again, don't really use any of these. I got this from, like, the dollar store when I was probably 12. <laughs> So that was this container. This is something that helps me put my eyelashes on, like my false eyelashes on. I got this for like a eyelash starter kit years ago. My eyelash curler. I have brow products. I have a um, brow, uh, like those gel things. I can't remember. This needs to be thrown out. It's a lash serum that I got probably I was 13 maybe. Um, my BH Cosmetics um, brow kit. I have mini scissors for my eyebrows, like to trim the long hairs, or sometimes I use them to trim my um, false eyelashes. One of my favorite eyebrow products, I benefit. This is in like deep or something. I love it. Really, really love this one. I actually just purchased a new one because yeah, I'm running out. I have, ah, oops. I have my NYX Tame and Frame. I love this. I have my NYX Micro Brow Pencil, love it. Um, these are my lip glosses, I'm not much of a lip gloss person, but I really do enjoy this lip gloss sometimes. It's Gerard Cosmetics in Nude. Um, this is by Philosophy, the smell or something, I remember this feeling very cheap, so yeah. Um, this is also one of my favorites, um, I love this one. It's Ananas in Lip Luster Fine Wine. I really like this one. This NYX one I've had since I was probably 13, and I have some ELF ones down there. And some NYC ones. These are like my lip butters, my Blistex, I have baby lips, chapsticks, that Blistex. Um, yeah. Lots. I really like this one for when I'm not really wearing makeup. I use this tinted lip balm by e.l.f. This one's nice too. I have a little panda one down there. This is really nice too. Yeah. Um, these are my drugstore lashes for the most part. Yeah, I really like these, though I kind of messed them up. I have individual lashes down there. I have some... I don't even know what these are from. What are they called? Ardell, I think. I got Ardell lashes, but I don't know which ones they are. But I have a bunch of these. I don't really wear these most of the time. I think I wear these sometimes because they're very natural. So if I'm looking for a natural look, I'll wear these. But I have some of my primers. I have a glitter glue. I have a Lorac primer. I have a L'Oreal primer, I have a Palladio primer? Palladio? I don't know. I have, I don't even know what this is, I think this is a sample that I got. I have an e.l.f. primer, and I have some primer samples. Mederma, I have, yeah, more samples. My collection isn't very impressive, to be honest. It's a lot of drugstores since I'm just graduated high school, you know, I don't really have time for a job right now, so I haven't really had the money to spend, but this is my champagne pop highlighter, most of these are highlighters, Laura Geller highlighter in um, Gilded Honey, I don't really like this, it's too much glitter, but I hear a lot of people love it, I just don't, I don't know, maybe I've had a bad one. Um, this is also purely just glitter, pretty much, but I hear some good reviews. I like this one. Um, I have like a glitter gluey thingy that I stole from my mom years ago. This is a nice drugstore highlighter. It's by Physician's Formula. I got it because I think Kathleen Lights mentioned it. These are my lipsticks. I really don't really use lipsticks too much. This is my Smashbox Instamat sample. Sorry, I forgot what this was, but it doesn't work, at least for me, but I'll keep it around. Um, I have some Milani lipsticks. I don't- I lost my other one. I had two of these. I had, yeah, this shade, which is 62 Matte Blissful, and I had a really nice one that 
I've, it's been missing for a really long time. I can't find it. I don't know where it is. Um, Jordana lipsticks, they're all dried out. I really don't recommend those. This is a Milani lipstick my mom used to use daily when I was younger, and I stole one. Um, the NYX Butter ones are nice. I have Wet n Wild lipsticks. Everybody raves about these, but I personally find them very dry. They don't apply at all unless I use my fingers. Um, I have Rimmel lipsticks, Maybelline lipsticks, Revlon lipsticks. Here's some more eyelashes. I'm actually wearing these right now. I have a th they have three of them. I like these a lot. Um, these are my lip pencils and a really junky lash glue that I just keep around. I have, yeah, these, a bunch of these. I have a crown um, lip pencil. I have Maybelline lip pencils. Palladio lip pencils. Um, yeah, I don't know what these are, but I have these. They're very creamy. Um, sorry I keep saying um. <laughs> I have a House of Lashes lash ruler so I can measure how long I want my lashes to be and then I trim them. Like my false eyelashes, not my real ones. And yeah. I have a Jessie's Girl one. I have a Cover Girl one right here. Yeah, I have a few. And then on top I have um, some, this is just like a heart thing my friend gave me. I have some hair stuff. And I really don't like gum, so random quarter. I use these Listerine pack things instead. I just don't like gum. I don't know. I'm just not a gum person, so this is nice. And then I have these from Amazing Savings. I painted over them in white. These have some Q-tips. This one has some cotton balls. And then I have my makeup brushes. I have some crown brushes. I have some Sigma brushes. I have some Morphe brushes. I have crown, yeah, did I say crown yet? I don't remember, I have e.l.f. brushes. I have some brushes I got from eBay, some Real Techniques brushes, so yeah, I have a lot of different brushes. I really like this one for contouring, it doesn't even say, but I'm pretty sure it's from Crown? Either Crown or Morphe, but they have very similar brushes, so yeah. And yeah, so these are also, this is from eBay, this is from Morphe, this is from I think Morphe. Crown, actually, this is from Crown. I use this for concealer sometimes. Um, pencil brushes from Sigma. Another pencil brush from. I have another pencil brush from. Um, I can't even remember. But yeah. This is Crown. Yeah, Sigma. This is Morphe. I have some BH Cosmetics ones, I have some Coastal Sense ones, I think. Yeah, so I have a lot of different kinds. If you want information on, like, specific ones, let me know. This is Crown. Yeah. And then I have, like, an eyebrow shaper, randomly, sitting here. I feel like I'm going through this really fast. <laughs> um, I have, yeah, more and more few ones. I think this is Morphe too. I use this for powder. Yeah. This is by e.l.f. I haven't used in a really long time. This is by... I think Crown. Looks like it's from Crown. Um, I think this is from Crown too. This is also good for contouring. Liquid lipsticks. That's what I usually use. Remember before I said I don't use lipsticks? I almost... I think every day I wear liquid lipsticks. I have some by ColourPop. I have this by Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme. I really like these dose of color ones. Um, one of my favorites, I think this is Bury Me. Yeah, Bury Me by Dose of Colors is really nice. Um, I have a L'Oreal liquid lipstick. Lonely Planet's liquid lipsticks are really, really, really nice. I love them. My favorite one, I think it's, is it New Pleasure? No, this one's Rebel Rebel. I wear it almost every day. I love it. I really, really, really love it. Highly recommend it. 
I have some Lime Crime ones. One by Rimmel. It's kind of, I think it's supposed to be a liquid lipstick. I have a Sephora one. I have a Revlon one. If you want any information on any of these, please let me know. I have some lipsticks by Revlon, e.l.f., NYX, Maybelline. I have my Hoola bronzer by Benefit. Um, I have my Sleek Contour Kit. I have a sample of the, like, I think they're chubby in the nude foundation sticks by Clinique. I have my favorite eyeshadow primer by Urban Decay. Oh my gosh. I have L'Oreal um, primer. I have some of my Maybelline primers. I have my favorite mascara as of right now by L'Oreal. I'm working really hard to buy strictly cruelty free makeup and yeah I'm having a really hard time with that but I'm definitely working on it so I have to find mascaras that are cruelty free. And then I have my favorite foundations and this one is by Becca, this one's by Revlon, no this one's by L'Oreal, this one's by LC, really nice foundation, oops, this one's by Makeup Forever, and then I have a BB cream. I have my concealers, this is by Maybelline, this is by Maybelline, CoverGirl, Maybelline, NYX, um, Maybelline, this one's really nice, um, it's by Benefit. Then I have my mirror I bought years ago, hi guys, I don't remember what it's, where it's from. And these stickers are from like purchases that I've made that they, they gave me stickers, like this from Colourpop, Airy. House of Lashes, Coastal Scents, stuff like that. I have my palettes here, some of them. Anastasia Contour Kit, Urban Decay Naked, Lorac Pro, Too Faced, Coastal Scents, The Balm by Anastasia, Crown, um, BH Cosmetics, I have some e.l.f. ones, and these are some L.A. Girl ones. I actually came by mistake. I ordered a eyeliner from them, and instead of them shipping me an eyeliner, they sent me all of their eyeshadow palettes instead. I've never tried them. Uh, I should probably try them. I have no idea what they're like at all. I've had them for, like, years already. I have my e.l.f. brush scent shampoo, Maybelline uh, makeup remover, I have off sharpeners. My friend gave this for, to me for my birthday. It's an eye pa yeah, an eyeshadow palette. I have an e.l.f. Yeah, a bunch of e.l.f. eyeshadow palettes down here. Sonia Kashuk. This is a nice one. I have an e.l.f. blush palette. This is really nice. I have a random um, makeup geek blush there. Because <laughs> I'm too lazy to buy a, a Z palette for it. I have hard candy palette, I have a Urban Decay palette, I have NYX palette, Naked Basics palette, I have more e.l.f. palettes down here, I have a Maybelline one, yeah, I have an e.l.f. one there, Beauty Blender here, I have a random puff thing, I have a lot of eyelashes, I have House of Lashes, I have Coco Lashes that are my favorite, I really, really highly recommend Coco Goddess Lashes, by the way favorite, favorite, favorite lashes. Um, I use these to fix my eyeliner sometimes. I dip these in like makeup remover. Or you can just buy this. It's already in eye makeup remover. Really nice. I use that for my eyeliner like every day. Um, I have another color switch here. I have random bag there. I have another benefit brow. I have another mascara. Um, Disposable wands, random um, fit me concealer. Yeah, I have that. I have a mirror here. I have a makeup bag. I have this. I think is filled with only Makeup Geek eyeshadows. It's a Z palette. I have some palettes I got from eBay that are pretty nice, actually. Um, they're blush palettes. Bronzer palettes, contour kits, I have a brush kit here, 
huge, so I'm not even gonna bother to take it out. Morphe palettes, I have like a 35O palette, I have the Jaclyn Hill palette, I have really colorful palette two, I have some beauty blender, like um, cleaner thing here, I have a makeup remover by Neutrogena, I have Coastal Scents palette, I really, really love. I have BH Cosmetics palettes, Coastal Scents palettes, So I have a lot of palettes here that I'd be making a huge mess, plus I'm holding the camera, but yeah, really, really big palettes. <laughs> Second to last drawer, I have my bronzers here, well some of them. I have Milani blushes, more Milani blushes, I have a Rimmel bronzer, Elf one, I have a NYX blush. See if I can take this out. I have a Laura Geller one. This is super, super old and nasty. I'm sorry, oh my god. Um, I have some lipsticks I got from eBay a while ago. Some very colorful ones. I have, I have NYX lipstick. I have Jordana lipsticks. I have e.l.f. lipsticks. So, Wet n Wild ones. Maybelline ones have this random sample of Dior foundation, it looks like. Favorite, favorite, favorite contour palette, Kat Von D. This is for when I want my eyeshadow to be really sharp. I just keep tape around. I have Fit Me Stick for contouring. Um, this by Maybelline, by the way, Fit Me Maybelline Stick, um, foundation stick. And then I have the L'Oreal Infallible Spray. I have my Urban Decay All Nighter Spray. This is really good for people who have like super dark circles. It's um, it's like a peachy concealer to cancel out, yeah, dark circles. Really like it. This is really nice too. I've had that for years. This foundation breaks me out, but I really do like it, but yeah, I haven't used it in forever. This is pretty nice too. This is my powder I use, Fit Me Rimmel Stay Matte powder. I have a lot of these um, Maybelline 24 hour color tattoos. Lots of them. Well, not lots, but I have a decent amount. Yeah, these are some. And I have two glitters by Coastal Scents. And I randomly have Hot Topic. Oh, this is an e.l.f. one. But I randomly have Hot Topic eyeshadows. Hot Topic. Um, this is by Physicians Formula pretty packaging. Used to love this, haven't used it in a long time. Elf blushes, Physicians Formula, um, bronzer, oops, and then Anara's one. Really, really pigmented. Okay. Last drawer. Finally. Okay. So I have cotton rounds, I have cotton balls and Q-tips. New whole thing of Q-tips. Teeth whitener kit. I have these things to decorate, like do nail polish designs with. I was really into that um, back in middle school. So I have a bunch of those. Yeah, these are for, well, this one's broken. <laughs> but yeah, bought these a long time ago, haven't taken care of them. Um, some nail stuff, yeah. Uh, my inhaler, nail glue, yeah. Okay, I really need to organize this drawer. Sorry about that. I have like an edge control thing because I have these baby hairs that stick up every time I try to do a ponytail. So, yeah, I guess that. I have nail polish remover. More cotton rounds. I have makeup bags, nail kit right here, and I have this thing to carry even more lipsticks. Like an epilator thing, I think that's what it's called. Pure acetone, um, yeah, that is another inhaler. That's another inhaler. Um, hair straightener. I have like a makeup mirror here. These are bath bombs. And then under here I just have my 
hair dryer, hair iron, hair curler. Okay. Then I have a jar of coconut oil, and I use that for my hair. And to moisturize sometimes. Yeah, I think that's it. So that was my makeup collection, and if you like this, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you have any video requests, please leave it in the comments below. I'm so sorry I keep disappearing. I disappear for like months at a time, put out a video, say I'm back, then I disappear again. I'm so sorry. <laughs> if you want to communicate with me, you can go on my Instagram and my Twitter, and I even have a Tumblr now, so if you want to go check out my Tumblr, you can check out my Tumblr. If you have any questions, please leave it in the comments below. Thank you so, so, so much for watching. I really appreciate all of you. I love you guys. Thank you. Bye.